From its beautiful coast and maritime rainforest climate in the west to its near desert climate in the east, Oregon is the yin and yang of United States geography. The Beaver State has almost every type of geography the planet has to offer. People have been coming to Oregon since Lewis and Clark showed up in the early 1800s. Take a step back from all the politics and look at Oregon for the places that amaze. This is Oregon. The painted hills in northwestern Oregon near Mitchell will destroy most people's mental picture of the rainy and green Oregon most describe. It rarely has either, yet it's an amazing sight. Phones are nice, but a legit camera can only capture what you're going to see here. Forget all the BS you hear about Portland, Oregon. Like all cities, it has its problems. But like all those cities, the good always outweighs the bad. People just pay attention to the bad more than the good. That's why you hear about it more. It's a money game. Portland is a city and an experience. I'm not sure which one comes first.
visit the Oregon coast, any place, it doesn't matter, and admire it for its unforgiving beauty. Smith Rock State Park is beautiful. It is known for its hiking, its river, and most of all, its rock climbing. One man explained it as a great place to spend a day, a week, or a lifetime. My nephew said he hates to visit because it's so hard to leave. That's a solid emotion about a place if you ask me. Oregon has about 238 waterfalls. Pick a couple, take a camera, a lunch, and someone you like. Sit down and enjoy a waterfall. Also, resist the urge to pee. Every time I go to the waterfalls, any one of them, 30 seconds after I get there, I have to pee. Don't know what that's all about.
almost any state you go to is going to claim that they have some of the best wine in the country. Maybe. Everyone has an opinion, and everyone has an argument on why theirs is the best. I think one of the most underrated wine regions in the United States is here in the Portland, Oregon area. Come visit, get your girlfriends together, go get your wine on. Standing over the Portland, Oregon skyline, like a giant vanilla ice cream cone, is Mount Hood. You always know if it's going to be a good day if you could see Mount Hood. No clouds, no nothing, just a straight shot to Mount Hood. I don't know if it's just because I grew up in Los Angeles County and we really don't have them, but something I really enjoy about Oregon is the rivers and creeks. You could just be walking in the woods and find a creek you never knew about. The rivers are amazing, the creeks are beautiful, sometimes you're there alone for hours, maybe even a whole day. Bring a book, bring a camera, and relax. Alright, so that's our video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you ever want to visit Oregon, use this as a guide, but keep in mind, there's a thousand other places that are probably as good as these. These are the ones I've visited that I've enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I have one on the national parks coming up next. Everybody have a great day. Be nice to each other.